The Mjolnir comes in three sizes, 100 and 75 liter, with a long frame and a 70 liter model with a shorter frame. Our skeletal support principle minimizes the painful loading on the shoulder, the neck and hips. The hip belt is pivoting on a V-frame, allowing free movement and free blood supply to all muscles. And the butterfly bridge on the shoulder harness will also unload the weight from your neck muscles to your shoulder and collarbone. Anna will demonstrate the 70 litre model and the features are the same on all three models. When you put on the backpack, it's important that you lift it by taking a steady grip at the handle and then help out with the shoulder straps. Start with the hip belt. The buckle is easy to use and also easy to open in emergency situations. It's also very hard to accidentally damage by stepping on it. Tighten the hip belt straps. You do this by pulling the upper webbing. The lower webbing should actually be quite loose not to strain your blood flow. The hip belt pillows should rest on your hips slightly angled. Now it's time to adjust the back length so it fits your length perfect. Pull the straps downwards so you get the load on your shoulders. You can alternate the load point during walk by releasing the strap and the load will be transformed to your hips or by tightening it to move the load to the shoulders. Ideally, you should have 70% of the weight on your hips and 30% on your shoulders, but this can vary with your own preferences. When this is done, it's time to adjust the actual shoulder harness. And important here is that the butterfly bridge is placed so it's on your shoulder bone and also slightly slanted forward towards your collarbone. This is something you do once. Next time you use it, it's perfect for your body. But if you're very tall or short or the backpack have been adjusted in the shop several times, you might need to adjust it. Make sure you start out with the buckle positioned in the medium line position. You open the small buckle on the webbing, marked with lines and plus and minus. You pull or loosen and move around the shoulder harness, until it's perfectly placed. The butterfly bridge position is your indicator here. Then fasten the buckle and do the same maneuver on the other side. Now it's time to customize the top adjusters. The top adjusters is adjusted by pulling the string very light. You open and close the string by pulling it to the side and then back. Both adjusters have to be pulled in the same direction to open and close. You pull lightly until the backpack feels firm and steady, but be cautious. If you pull too hard, it will be strained on the front of your body and it will cause you pain. Then you have to loosen it. Now Anna is ready to go. The breast strap with a small whistle is not necessary to close, unless you are narrow-shouldered and it feels like the shoulder harness is about to fall off. Then you buckle up the breast strap to keep the shoulder harness together. When you look at the backpack from the side, you can actually see through. There's no padding on unnecessary parts towards your back. The padding is where the load is, hips, lower back and shoulder. This means we leave a big area free for ventilation and air that can come through. As you can see, the frame that is higher than the backpack supports the tent shelf and in this way anything placed on top of the backpack will be centered. The load will be well distributed and it also prevents the upper load to fall forward towards your neck. As Anna starts to walk, the hips can move freely without having to lift the entire load of the backpack with every move. This is possible with pivoting VFlex free harness system. The backpack remains fairly still although the hips are moving. Now it's time to take off the backpack. Open up the hip belt buckle and take off the backpack with the help of the handle. Remove the tent by releasing the tension on the cords and unhook them from the frame. The roll opening opens up the backpack. Unhook the D-rings from the red metal hooks. Roll it open and see what's inside. A big compartment and also a small zip pocket for valuable items you don't want to lose, like your favorite mouse. There's also a roll opening at the bottom, attached by D-ring and hook. Ah, and here we find another friend. You can separate the inside of the backpack by a small shelf and thus have the opening serving one compartment each. 
The roll opening allows you to carry more than 70 liter, that is the leveled measurement. And it also allows you to compress the volume by rolling further. Now Anna will demonstrate how you fasten one of your accessories. We have many accessories for our backpacks. And they can all be placed on any of the 148 attachment points on the Mjölner backpack. This is the 6 liter side pocket. As you can see, the pocket has webbings with red metal toggles. You attach the side pocket by fastening the toggles into the whole webbing on the backpack. Adjust it by pulling the webbing so the pocket sits tight. The whole webbing is placed so it allows you to choose various positions for your accessories. When you turn the backpack, you'll find a zipped pocket right in the middle, between the shoulder straps. In this pocket, you can place a soft plastic water container and the hose can be pulled out through the upper opening and then twisted around the top adjuster cord and placed conveniently for your use. When you look at the hip belt, you'll find the upper pillow part thicker than the lower part. It should be like this to comfort you the best way. The seam that goes across the front pillow is an indicator where your hips should be placed. There's a big memory foam pillow in the middle that will sit right on your lower back for comfort. And as you see, the big pillow can move forward and backward towards the V-frame and this allows it to be very comfortable, no matter what shape you have on your backside. It's very convenient for women. In between the big pillow and the smaller ones on the sides, there's no padding and it should not be. This is where your big muscles need to have room for movement. This backpack is very technically advanced, but at the same time one of the easiest to use. Let's do it once again. Bring it on, waist buckle closed, adjust the back length and ready to go. To carry heavy loads will always be painful and stress for your muscles. With our Mjölner and the skeletal support system, you will find it easier and you will be able to walk longer distances and enjoy your trekking more. Have a great tour!